Celia and Brian have come here today to make a solemn promise. They have come here before you and before God to make public their love for each other, to declare their choice to live and to partner and to grow together. And so I ask you now, if you are in approval of this union, please signify by your applause. So today is the wedding. The marriage is a lot more complicated. There's some good times. There's also some times that are going to be a little rough. But together, with the support of each other, and all these people that gave you their applause and cheers, this will be something that you can do. All right, how many married couples are here? Easy, nothing to it, right? So are you ready? Helio, it took far too long for our paths to cross. You are literally the perfect match for me. And you make me happier than I ever imagined possible. You're the one I tell all my secrets to. The one who pushes me to do things I never thought I could do. The one who helps me conquer my fears, especially on days I need it the most. We've been in love for eight short years, but it honestly feels like I've known you forever. Of course, we cannot be certain what exactly will come next, but nothing in life scares me ever because I have you by my side. Together we've discovered the amazing adventure life can be, and there's no one else I'd rather go on that journey with than you. For as much as Keely and Brian have consented together in wedlock and have witnessed the same before us, and have promised to be true to each other, and have declared their same by joining hands, now pronounce that you are husband and wife as long as you both shall live. You may now kiss the bride. We are so incredibly happy and honored to have all of you here with us today. We know that everybody in this room has traveled to be here, many of you with considerable effort, and so it's, we're so appreciative of that to have you here today to celebrate this great day with Kelia and Brian. So the year was 1993, and there would be this tiny little girl with these big blue eyes who'd stare up at me and say, Daddy, I'm happy you home. As the kids were growing up, there were many sayings that we would use with them. And one of my favorites was, do your best, have fun. And so, Keely, I can tell you that when it came to selecting the person to spend the rest of your life with, you absolutely did your best with Brian. I am Brian's older brother. I know I paved a great road for him to follow. Even though I did have my doubts, like whenever I would come home from college and it looked like you'd been sleeping on the couch for a week. You clearly have turned into a wonderful adult. I'm just really proud of you and the person you've become. As we get older, we seem to get closer and closer. So I look forward to more of that. Keely and I have been best friends for 25 years and being best friends with Keely involves a lot of laughing, a lot of drinking beer and a lot of eating pizza. And then when she met Brian, they did a lot of laughing a lot of drinking beer, and a lot of eating pizza. And so I knew from that moment that Kelia had found a new forever friend, and so did I. So, Kelia, I'm so happy you found a home with Brian. And so the two of you toast to Brian and Kelia. They always do their best, I can tell you that. And they always find time for fun. So to the two of you. 